Hello everyone, I am Ambika Krover. I hope you are all well and enjoying indoor gaming. We all love watching movies, aren't we? Today, we are going to go to have a fun discussion about one of my favorite movie. And I have watched this movie many times but never got bold. So, I am talking about Inside Out. It is a 2015 3D computer animated movie produced by Pixels Animations Studios and released by Walt Disney Pictures. The whole concept revolves around a young girl named Rylish and she is 11 years old. Her family is uprooted and um, moved to Fran San Francisco. This is very stressful time for her. Inside Out takes place in inside of her mind which is a control room. Here in this new place she has no friends. She will go to new, new school and this place is so new to her that she is not finding cool things around her. She is not finding her friends around her. She is not finding that fun and enjoyment around her. This is, yes, very stressful for an 11-year-old girl, of course. So, what she do? She, she questions herself. She gets snippy with her parents and while all these emotions are affecting her in this movie we go inside her brain and all these characters these emotions in this movie all the emotions has personified as characters as we get to see joy sad disgust anger and fear they all interact as actual controlling her brain inside Riley's mind. Don't worry, I'm not going to give you any spoiler of the movie, but I'm telling you this is amazing production of Pixel Animation Studios. We will be seeing all these personified characters of her mind, which are actually emotions. We will see all the important roles of these emotions, which these emotions plays inside our brain it happens with all of us sometimes we feel so happy sometimes we feel angry sometimes we feel sad sometimes we feel discuss about something and sometimes we feel the fear right so in this movie you are going to learn three things or you can say three lessons when you will be watching this movie you will go to see you will be learning very first the bond between Riley and her family which you will be able to relate with your family second one the honesty the friendship between Riley and her friends and her family the bond the third thing how to control your emotions sometimes our emotions controls us but the best part is in actual life we have the control we all love to stay happy to stay with the joyous emotion but the best part which i got to learn with this movie is sometimes sadness plays an amazing role between you and your close ones to spend some time have you noticed when we feel sad what the very first thing we do we find our parents, we find our mother to whom we can talk about the things which are disturbing us or which, uh, which we are not feeling comfortable with. And sometimes when we feel scary, we go to our mother or father and tell them that I am feeling scary, please stay with me. Right? That is the best emotion. That is also best emotion. When we go out, we feel joyous, we feel happy. Aren't we? So basically, this movie is going to help you with all the best inside you. What you need to do, just see the movie once and you will be able to relate every moment with yourself and 
you will be feeling very amazing after this you will be finding it so relatable to you and so inspiring to you do watch this movie and then let me know if you like it as the way i like it and for sure you will be familiar to all these emotions which are actually inside yourself you just need to go and check all the you just need to realize how beautiful emotions are actually and obviously these emotions plays a very important role in everyone's life do watch this movie okay and then for sure discuss about this movie with your friends with your family and yes of course your teacher so this was all about inside out we will be meeting soon in next session talking about a new movie which will be equally beautiful as this one thank you